I want to thank the chairman. I want to thank Mr. Brady. I want to thank Earl uh, Blumenauer and Mr. Buchanan uh, for a great job that they did. Um, and also Mr. Lighthouser. Uh, he's a different kind of guy, and I really believe that he was essential to getting uh, <coughs> to this vote today. You know, uh, in my entire political life, uh, I've never had anyone say to me that, like, as was said today, that if you, if you vote against this, you're voting for the status quo. I mean, I even got a Jerry Garcia tie on today. I, me and the status quo don't agree most of the time. So uh, there's some questions that do remain. The ship of human rights has not been righted. The president never once mentioned in any speech during 2016 to now about human rights, about workers' rights in discussing NAFTA. Mexican workers are still being treated like chattel. American jobs will still flow to other countries. Protection unions will still own the day. So, the BIS bill has made the improvements, many improvements, but it's not enough. And some could say, well, is there ever enough? There are too many questions. Will Mexico be held accountable to fully enforce their labor laws? We don't know. 